Hello. Welcome back to the stream. Hello. Does 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 said work? Hello. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Okay, what's going on? Harold? Is is this working? It's a new mic, so this is all rushed, so this is a really cheap mic. We literally just ran to Walmart and got it, so hello? Tell me if it sounds good. Sounds trash. Tell me, please comment. Please, like seriously. This is Haro. Okay. Please declare that as nicer because I can't have that. Sorry. Um, I will get demonetized. I'm sorry. I'm going to remove that comment, please, because you put it too straightforward. Sorry about that, but um, hello, everybody. I have to get rid of some comments because YouTube will take down the videos because now you can your video can get taken down uh, from comments. And Yeah. Welcome back to talk. Oh, I forgot to do the right intro. Hey, everyone. Welcome back to Talk Attack, where we talk a lot. Um, there's no guest today, so... Oh. Hello. Is it working? Does it sound bad? It's okay. Um, just to find out if it sounds bad or not, I'm going to play it. Sorry if it's pretty bad. It's probably horrible, but yeah. If y'all can, if the fan is loud, hold on. I'll turn off the fan because the fan's probably interrupting. This time I'm in a different setting so because the lighting was really bad. So the lighting should be better. Okay, now the, um, the mic audio good. Or is it really bad? Because if it's bad, I'm probably going to have to get a, um, a snowball. Like, like uh, Jordan. Oh, he actually used a face cam once. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Please tell me how the mic is. How raw? Here. Let's play it. I'll be right back. Let me get some headphones. Headphones, headphones, we need headphones. Headphones. Where where are they? Um I don't know why my headphones are gone. Alright. What? I have no idea where my headphones are. Um I don't know where my headphones are. I'm gonna open the windows too. Sorry guys, this is like crashed. I had to start it immediately. My headphones are gone. Where the heck is Waldo? Where is Waldo? There they are. Waldo took them and hid them. Sorry about that, guys. Waldo took my headphones. Hello, Alex. Welcome to the stream. Ooh, my back just cracked. Okay. Let's see how the live stream is. Oh, I'm scared to hear it. Hello? Is 
Is it good? Do the do. Do biddy 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 do 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 do. But up it up bum 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 bobbity bob it up get out. Okay, it's not bad. Okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, it's it's not too bad. At least um, at least it's all right. I'll put it here if you want. Hello, everybody. Um, this is some ASR stuff going on here. I'm gonna open the windows for better lighting. Okay. You'll be able to hear. Actually, no, I'm just gonna make the curtains. See the light. Or here, see the light. There you go. Uh, it should be a lot brighter now. I think it's, it's yeah, it's like 3.30 or something like that. Should be bright, bright outside. There, is that better, everyone? Is this, is this a lot better? What I see on the camera, it looks pretty good. Um, so yeah, the lighting isn't too bad. Uh, they don't know what y'all are seeing, so. Okay, this is not a bad live stream anymore. I don't have a background still. It's still green screen. Still doesn't look too bad. If I move the camera over, is that good? Yeah, so you can't see that shit shadow over there. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Hello everyone, welcome back to Talk Attack, where we talk a lot. Hi everybody, let's the attack. Let the attack begin, yeah. Alright. Ooh, that I think that sounds good. Yeah, I like that. Let the talk of it uh, let the talk be let the attack begin. Okay. Um I'm doing good. How are you guys? I see everybody seems cheerful in the comments. Um yeah. Okay, um, ASMR, sure, um, I'll do it, I don't know, isn't ASMR where you take, where people, like, eat food, like, really close to the microphone, that's, that's weird, the feeling when you have 12 a.m., <laughs> you're up at 12 a.m., it's 348, uh, where I am, so, I'm doing good. No, I don't use WhatsApp because that reveals your phone number. And everybody's like, oh, you can trust me. Sorry, can't trust. Because that's that's too much on the line. So, yeah, I don't do WhatsApp. But what I do do now, I did not say that. What I also do now is... Deviant art, deviant art. I don't know how you pronounce it. Deviant, deviant art. I do that now. I'm in the middle of drawing a mini mouse. It's going really bad right now. Um, it's not too bad. I got the nose all right, and the head I did really good, but the outline is so scribbly. Anyway, last night I did. Uh, I joined last night. I made a Mike Wazowski last night. It's not too bad either. Um, it's really not too bad. I only have it on my computer, so I don't know if I can actually show it. But it's not too bad. It's basically, I had to do a bunch of layers. There's a shadow layer, so like there's, he actually has like a shadow. Um, part of his is like, him is like shaded, and it's perfectly shaded. I did the eye extremely well. His eye looks great. I got, like, the change of color in his eye color. I got, like, the dark blue and then the blue, light blue on the bottom. Um, and I did, like, the the circle really good on his eye. I even did, like, a little downward arch on his the top of his eye. So he's, like, mad. And then I put his arms up in the air like this. And... His mouth was open, and I even gave him a brace, 
and it just looks great to me for first drawing. I don't draw very well, so yeah, no, that can't happen. Sorry. Thank you. Um, this is actually my sister's necklace. She put it on me for some reason. And I just left it on. So, yeah. Welcome, welcome. So, if you see the title, if you can read, and if you read the title, I'm going to teach you how to make money on YouTube. So, I explained it on, I think, last time I explained it. Um, it's pretty, I pretty badly explained it. But, I'm going to explain it a little better this time. How to make money on YouTube. So, right now, that I know of, um, there are two... Right, okay. That was really bash. Okay. As I currently know, there are two ways. That's four. But there are two ways to make money on YouTube. Monetization and sponsors. There's probably other ways, but yeah. So to get monetized, you have to make an AdSense, and you have to have a bank account, and you set that all up, and you have to transfer money to AdSense, and then the AdSense transfers it into your bank account. And AdSense is basically just allowing to put ads on stuff. You need AdSense for websites, to put ads on websites, and apps, and YouTube, and all that stuff. So AdSense is pretty much used everywhere for making if you want ads on whatever your thing is that you made so that's how to get monetized and you have to have 1,000 subscribers and you have to have 4,000 watch time in hours in the past year 365 days so yeah it's pretty tough and monetization doesn't make a lot but it, it doesn't make it's not too bad um, I figured out recently how to make more, so that's the secret now. So, yeah, I found out how to make a lot. So, not a lot, a lot, okay? Not too much. Um, it's less than a dollar, but still, it's something. Yay. Okay. Uh, the other way is sponsors. And to get sponsors, you have to have a good amount of videos, good quality videos, like good lighting, a good microphone, a just good stuff. And you also have to have at least some subscribers, at least some sort of a fan base. Because sponsors aren't going to sponsor someone with zero subscribers. You have to get it, at least somebody that would like to buy. Sponsorships, they try to encourage, they ask you, okay, so they pay you, I'll get into this later in the in the live stream, but there's three other ways that they can do it. But let's just say it's the first way where they pay you. So they pay you to mention their item, their um, their company, their list of items, their I don't know what you'd call it, their selected item, and they pay you to mention it and show how good it is. Let's say they gave you a mouse. See, what you'd have to do is you'd have to show the mouse and you'd have to explain how good it is. It's got a good turn. It's got good clicks. It comes in many colors, let's say, and it's just overall good quality. And it only takes this amount of batteries. Uh, let's say I had a colorful one. Like it had buttons on the side, like the keyboard on the side of the mouse. That exists. So you have to show how good the thing is. And why they pay you to do that is because they want you to have enough of an audience that at least a couple of people from your audience decide to go and buy that mouse. And that way, you get money from it, you benefit, and the company gets customers. So the company benefits. So that's how to get sponsors. There's three ways to sponsor. Don't remember one of them. One way to sponsor is... For them to pay you to show off their item um, or their company or their app. So I told you how to do that. They basically pay you a, couple, a little bit of money. And yeah, um, the second way is for them to send you an item. 
So let's say if you were sponsored by a company that makes mouses, they would send you one of their mouses and you'd have to show off their their mouse. And yes, I'm covering the the um the logo. <laughs> um they didn't sponsor me, so yeah. So you'd have to show off the mouse, show how cool it is, maybe use it a little bit. So yeah, you just have to show off and like you have a like 30 to a minute of 30 seconds to a minute of just showing off their their stuff. So yeah, that's that's how to get sponsors and monetization I explain that. So that's how to make money on YouTube. Explained it a lot better there. See so the products. There you go. The products. You have to show off their product. It's called product endorsement. Oh, okay. I don't know what endorsement is, but yes, you have to show off their product, their item, whatever you want to call it. Uh, yes, I am in fact having a good day. I got a new mouse today. Although I woke up this morning and spilled my drink on my computer. The computer is fine. I seem to be lucky with that. Every time I spill something on my computer, it's fine. Like I spilled like buckets of water on it and it's fine completely fine not on purpose okay they fell on it and i don't know why they were there but they did fall on the computer so yeah that happened uh i'll, I'll tell some stories this time so stories are kind of harder without other people usually you'd have another person on it to like help you out with the story like a uh a suspect if you'd say like you have to have another person who witnessed it um but never mind you don't have to i do have that but it's better to have more people so if you want a guest on the show go ahead and ask also if you want to sponsor me go ahead i will gladly be sponsored i'll be sponsored by anything i'll show off your game whatever okay um yeah move my hair out of my face so that's a thing. I hope I'm not yelling right now. Because I seem to do that a lot. I talk loud. That's a thing. So yeah. If you want to sponsor me, I'll gladly be sponsored. In fact, I'll wear a hat right now. Because my hair is being really annoying. Yeah. Let's see. Ooh, I'll wear this hat. Everything is blurry. Can't read the comments because they're really blurry. Yeah. If you want to sponsor me, I'll gladly be sponsored. This is probably going to be my thumbnail uh, when I'm done. Here, I'll pose for the thumbnail. Okay, this is called the money alien. Ooh, I'm just now getting comments. Okay. No hat, your hair is good. Yes, my hair is long. It's cool. A cool color. I'm trying to turn it blonde. I'm not dying it. I'm going to sit out in the sun a lot each day, a couple hours a day. At least be in the sun, get my hair real light. I want a lighter. I want lighter hair. My hair used to be really blonde. It was nice. Uh, You're fine, Lucas. I don't mind. Yeah, sorry. I have to get close to see things. It's extremely blurry. My vision is blurry. What is that? Oh, it's the shadow of this. Okay. Leave that out of the way. Yeah, let's get it nice and bright up in here. Okay, that's hard to wear. So, if y'all want, I feel like Jack sent a card. Shout out to Jacksepticeye uh, for being a good YouTuber. Really good YouTuber. Here we go. Let's wear a nice hat for once. Yeah. Sorry for the background noise again. There's probably none. I hope there's none. Because the new mic says it should block out other noises. So it's only one directional. It's only picking up noise from where I am. So... Yeah. Oh, my hair. So I found out for my record for uh, people on my live stream was 60 people at one time. That's insane. So, yeah, I found that out. Anyway, I want to tell a story time now because I said I would earlier and I ended up not doing it. So I'm going to tell a story time about uh, a couple days ago. 
Um, I don't know what I call this story, but it is the suspicious drone man. Okay, that's that's what we're gonna talk this about. So, me and my mom and grandma and my sister, we're gonna go for a walk. You know, just go for a walk, a nice walk. I was on my bike. Sailor was in her new stroller, and there it is. And then my mom and my grandma were walking. And so we're walking down the street, like a block away from our house. This man, this dude, don't worry, he's nice. Um, this dude was fishing, and he had his van parked right next to it. So he's fishing, and he says, hey, hey, come here. I want to show you something cool. Um, he said, I want to show you something. This will blow your mind. It's a giant drone. And my mom says, okay, Oakley, let's see it from a distance. And he walks over to his van, opens it. And th don't worry, this guy was completely innocent. Okay. So we walk over. Um, we see this thing. I'm backing off with my bike. I'm, I, if he, don't worry, I had a backup plan for the situation. I knew that what, it, what could happen. I knew what could everything that could happen. I was getting ready to pick up my bike. If he even touched them, I would throw the bike at him and I'd grab everybody. We'd run. Um, but he opens the van. We walk over and he has a giant drone. He has this huge metal drone. He built himself. It took him seven years, he said. And apparently it can pick up up to nine people. That is insane. He said he, he's a mechanic. I'm sure he's a mechanic. He didn't say he was. But he he was talking, going on and on about how he built all this stuff. And he learned about how gas infects the environment. He made himself an electric car. He showed us pictures of it. Uh, he showed us pictures of 12-foot drones. Huge drones that could pick up tons of people. And he was explaining how he's trying to make better equipment for like firefighters and stuff, not for it, but for him to help people, he could help people. And he's showing how he, he made a drone without using this auto balance thing. He was saying that he put so much weight on the bottom that it would hold it down and it would stay upright and it could go 12 feet up in the air and it would fall back down. Um, and no, he said though, I think he said the height was 12 feet. And he had to make it 12 feet because of how the weight works. If he did it nine feet, it would fall over. If he did it even lower than that, it would just like fly away and blow away and also tip over. So he shows us the drone. He shows us pictures and he shows us like all the stuff he builds. And he said he's going to take a year of break. Pretty cool. It was actually really cool. He had this giant drone in the back of his car. Uh, he was explaining how he didn't want to he didn't want to um, fly it because if one of them broke one of the propel if it fell and one of the propellers broke he'd have to spend another year make repairing it and he said he's tired of it but he just wanted to show us that because he thought it was amazing I think it's amazing that's insane and he's talking about how if there was a fire in a building and somebody needed to get out. He could easily help someone. All he had to do was take the drone out. And any he was explaining how he's trying to make drones that anybody can fly. They don't have to know how to balance it. So he's explaining how he anybody can fly it. Anybody. Doesn't matter who wants to fly it. Like they can fly it. And he's also explaining how he could just fly it up the building. Person could hop on the drone, hold on, strap themselves in, and he could fly them right back down. Nine people in one thing. I think that's personally pretty cool. That's really cool. If you're a mechanic, that's insane. Um, it looked really cool. He just wanted to show us that because he thought it was mind-blowing. It was truly mind-blowing. He's trying to help it, um, upgrade equipment. So I thought that was pretty cool. That's a story time. And we continued on our walk. The walk was fine. So, yeah, that was a cool um, – that was a cool – experience i think that was actually a couple like yesterday or something it was like two days ago maybe i think it was yesterday yeah anyway so i thought that was pretty cool self so story time for once 24 minutes okay i've already run out of content
I'm going to go and turn on my fan because it's getting really hot in here. It gets pretty hot in here. If it's hot, it's really hot in here. It's This is the hottest room in the house. If it's cold, this is the warmest room in the house. This is like the hot room. I don't know what it up. I think it's because it's like the open part. But, yeah. Here, let's see here. Let's see how the... The mic is doing. Let's keep up on it. Hello, this is a mic, and it's doing real good. Hello. Okay, you can't really hear anything in the background. What if I turn it up? I feel like I'm about to get ear blasted. Okay, it's not too bad. You can't hear anything in the background. Okay. It's not too bad. It has a little bit of a ear ear to it, so what does my hat say? It says Everest. No, the Everglades. Everglades. It's a section of Florida. It's the swampy part of Florida. It's like, I think it actually makes up like 35 or something percent of Florida. So. How, hello. I'm doing good, Paul. How? I hope you're doing good too. Because I care about my audience. Okay. Let's see here. Let's turn that off. I mean, I wouldn't say. Hold on, I, don't, I still have it on top chat. I want to see live chat. I want to see all comments. There we go. Thank you. Uh, most people like it. Although it's doing pretty bad. Its analytics are pretty low. It's all right. It's all right. I'll continue it if nobody. I mean, all the people that are active on my channel like it. All the people who – there's a lot of people that are actually – I think YouTube's, like, suggesting this podcast because a lot of new people are coming from this. So I like that. But the – and all the original people that actually, like, my content aren't here for um, the, uh, in, the the I, ICB, the ICB challenge. Um, they usually don't like it. But all the people – that are here for good content, they usually like it. So, yeah. What is the time now in America? It's always different. We're, um, Eastern side right now is 4.09 p.m. So, yeah. What application I use for talking? What do you mean? The mic? This is a new mic. I honestly don't know what it is. I think it's a Walmart branded mic. It was either this or a Yeti, and the Yetis were out. And if you don't know, Yetis are really, really, really expensive. For, for me, they are, are at least. So the Yeti's probably not coming around anytime soon. You know what the next thing is, though? A new – you get – wait, no. You might you probably didn't guess it. A new camcorder, a webcam, a new webcam. So, yeah, I'm going to get one of the expensive webcams. So, yeah, it'll be an actual – good webcam i'll be i'm gonna happy i'm gonna happy about that yeah oh dear i'm trying to review this to make sure it's good see highest quality what is the highest quality 720 okay we're gonna make that 1080 yeah that's right we're gonna make this 1080 boy Steven sent 720 is pretty it's it's good it's it's not the best I like 1080 1080 is the best 4k is too much you can only view it on a 4k TV so I'm sure nobody are ah, not saying that uh, I'm sure not too many people have a 4k TV a lot of people have 4K TVs. I'm sure some of you guys have 4K TVs. 
Um, I don't think you'd want to watch my videos on a 4K TV. My videos are too bad for that, so. Wait, Omar, oh, forgot to tell you that YouTube is not doing going to. What do you mean it's not you're not you're not going to do it or YouTube is not going to do it? What do you mean? Oh the bullying thing? But wait for YouTube to upload it? Uh, they probably won't. They honestly don't care. They only make they never mind, I'm not saying anything. Um They're trying to build an audience. That's what they're trying to do. They're trying to make benefits, so they got they gotta do good, like big ideas. Big ideas, like YouTube Rewind was a big idea because it had Fortnite in it. That didn't end very well. I think it's the most disliked video right now, actually. I think Yeah, that's the most disliked video, I think. Too many wires. Wow, there's tons of my wires right now. So many. Too many wires. Okay, we're going to go to YouTube, and we're going to look at the Rewind. I think it's the most disliked video. Do you use Vine application? I have no idea what that is. Do you have a good weekend and a good day today? Yes, I did. I'm exhausted, though. So, yeah. Uh, um, this year's YouTube Rewind wasn't exactly what it should be. YouTube, I think YouTube Rewind should be reflecting on all the things that happened in 2018. It shouldn't be about like what it was it's just yeah it didn't reflect as it should have done pewdiepie's was all about memes and stuff of 2018 but he also put a section in there of in loving memory of stan lee and all that stuff so good for pewdiepie for putting that in but yeah there was i don't know it has 15 million dislikes. Oh my gosh. That's the most disliked video. I can guarantee that. <laughs> but I don't like what it became. It was just all about Fortnite. Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite. All about Fortnite. And I really do not like that. Um, because... It's trying to attract a kid audience. It's not trying to, it's, try, I don't know. It's trying to attract a mature audience for kids. It, they're trying to make it a kid website. And they think kids only like Fortnite. I don't know what they think, but they just, they seem to love Fortnite. And I don't know. It's just too much. It's all about Fortnite now. And I just don't like that. Even Tafu was talking, he said something about that. He's saying something about how they're putting in too much stupid stuff in Fortnite. And they're making it too childish. There's too many tryhards. So, tryhards and the dancing was, ugh, just ruined it for me. This is going to get demonetized, I can guarantee that right now. How si how si doing? I don't win goods. How I use about Fortnite, yeah, it's always, uh, yes, you were, you were right, Scottish poke, poke training. I mean, it's not a horrible game. Okay, so I think Fortnite, the basics of it, like what it's trying to go for, I think the overall story of it is pretty good. The dancing is absolutely no, do not know dancing. That, that ruined it. The tryhards, the dances, the, oh, I bet at you, and the exotic people. It's just uh, that uh, that made it a horrible game. But the basics of it are great. I think it's a good idea because PUBG is basically Fortnite without the building, without the dances. I know they do have dances in it, um, but it's not as – they actually – I don't know. It's just PUBG it just seems better. There's not a, there's not as many tryhards. There's not as many. I don't know. It's just not exo as exotic. It's more straightforward, realistic. See, uh, yeah, that's what I think. You're gonna do a workout video. Oh, good luck with that. Yes, I know I did a Fortnite dance video because I like the dances. 
I, I know I just said I don't like them. I don't like the way people make them in Fortnite. Like, they take them from people and absolutely no credit. No credit at all to the people who actually made them. So, I don't like that. But I do like the dances from the actual people. Like, um, let's say... Will Smith, he made it. He made one of them. He made I don't know. I don't remember which one, but I think that's pretty cool. Orange Justice has a good origin. The poor kid was bullied, so good for him. Yeah, Battle Royale ain't my type. I, I like Battle Royale. I like those kind of games. Um, just because it's just for fun. Although I don't exactly. I'm not exotic with those games though. I like um, other types of games, like creative games, like Gmod. I like that better, a lot better. I like the uh, the idea of being able to make whatever you want, whatever creatures. I like getting a, a bunch of animals into the game, a bunch of vehicles and effects. I got the fire effects and stuff. I also like uh, City Skylines. That's a good one. You get to make your city, and you actually learn about stuff. You learn about how cities work. Um, you learn about taxes and loans and all that stuff. Uh, yeah. I also like Universe Sandbox, too. I don't have that yet, but that's on my wish list. Um, I like the idea. You get to learn a lot about space, and I love space. So, hello, Boysen. Um, could you tell me why someone should be okay? Um... I don't know if they, whatever they're interested in. I I honestly, it's their opinion. I don't know. Thank you for liking my talk attack thing. Fantasy sci-fi are the games I like. Yeah, fa fantasy's pretty cool. Those are cool games. Like Link, uh, Legend of Zelda. That's a good one. That's a good fantasy game. Pretty sure it's fantasy. <laughs> um. Sci-fi. I don't really know a sci-fi ga game, but I know they're good. I know, I like that idea of futuristic, like, lightsabers and that kind of lasers and stuff. I like those kind of games. Red Hot is a sci-fi game, I think. I don't know what Red Hot is. No, Super Hot. Super Hot. That's a sci-fi game, I think. That's a pretty good one. What about Halo 4? Halo 4 is pretty good. I like Halo. I like the idea of alien invaders and, like... Master Chief, uh, Master Chief, um, yeah, I like Master Chief and Cat and all the others, I forgot the others' names, but I used to know all their names, I have Halo Reach, I like Halo Reach, so, yeah, Skyrim, good one, Oblivion, I've heard of that one, uh, Morrowind, don't know that one, good games, though. I'm sure they are. I love Skyrim. Good. I love Skyrim. I don't have it, but I know it's a good game. Like that's one of the best games I think in history. Uh, Legend of Zelda is one of the best games in history. Like the ones that the the originals, originals is what I'd call it. Legend of Zelda is definitely original. Sonic is an original. Those are all good games. Do you like sports? Yes, I love sports. No, I'm not a super MT. I'm not one of those people. I just probably just blew all your ears off. Sorry about that. I'll quiet down a little bit. Would you like me to get a little quiet? You know, like this kind of quiet. Um, yes, I like sports. I, um, I like football. I don't like watching them. I like playing them. I like playing football. I can play baseball. I can play soccer. I can play volleyball. I'm pretty good at volleyball. I'm good at football. I'm good at. I'm not. I'm okay at baseball. I'm pretty. I ho I'm horrible at basketball. I'm pretty good at s soccer. So yeah. Oh, um, have you played the UFC game? No, I don't have any sports games. I don't like sports games that much. I mean, base the baseball ones are not bad, but yeah. Other than that. Uh, I respect you. I respect you. <laughs> I respect. Gotta have some respect. What's your favorite car brand? I don't know. Um, 
Actually, I do know. I'd have to go with Mustang. I'm pretty sure that's a car company. I like a Mustang. Mustangs are my type of cars. Oh, dear. That was my keyboard. Does it still work? Are we still working? Can I type? Yep, still works. I think. Wait, it only typed two letters. Yeah, I keep clicking enter. That's why it's doing that. Yeah, my key keyboard's working. Okay, what's your favorite car brand? Mustang. I think that's a brand. Uh, have you ever played the game Eisen? Can't say. I don't play many games. I'm just starting to use Steam, so. Do you like H H1Z1? I've heard of that. I definitely have heard of that. Hold on, I'll look that up real fast. H1Z1. H. Yes, I've seen H1Z1. Isn't that the new Call of Duty game? Is that the new Call of Duty game? Or is that a new one? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I like PUBG, though. I like PUBG better. That's probably the best Battle Royale game, I'd say. Skyrim is Elder Scrolls Five. Wait, there's Elder Scrolls. That's what that is? Oh, okay. So it's like an Elder Scrolls series, but then they give them different names. So Morrowind, Skyrim. Okay. I think I, I think I know what you're talking about. Okay, that's pretty cool. Sorry. There's so many. I'm trying to go through them all. Uh, no, come on. German cars are best. You need to buy a Mercedes Benz uh, with all that YouTube cash. Don't have any YouTube cash. Um... That in the thumbnail, that that money in the thumbnail, that's like six, seven dollars, and that's not from YouTube. Um, Jeremy got Mercedes Benz. I know Mercedes Benz are pretty good. Um, expensive though. I'm pretty sure they're expensive. You should play the game Eisen. I'll look that up. No sponsors. No sponsors. Okay. Uh, I'm not sponsored. I'll gladly take some sponsors. Gladly. I'll snatch them right out. Okay. Looking up. Uh, I. Bibbidi boop. What is this? It's not showing up. Hold on. Trying to find it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay. It's not showing up for me. I don't know what's up with that, but... Oh, dear. Okay. Oblivion was number four. Okay. So, so it went Morrowind, Oblivion, and Skyrim. Fallout. Fallout was a good one. That's a good one. I like Fallout. Ever heard of... Oath Kilt by? No, I've n not heard of that. What about the game? I don't know what that game is, but I'm pretty sure that is what I think it is. Um, yes, I explained earlier in the video how to make money. I started around five minutes, I think, explaining. Okay, I'll explain how to make money right now. So basically, there's two ways to make money on YouTube. You can't – hold on. I'll back up a little bit for better quality. Okay? This is better. I like this better. So basically, there's sponsors, and you can monetize. To monetize, you have to have AdSense, which basically allows you to have ads. You need that for adding ads to websites, apps, and YouTube videos. And you have to connect your AdSense with your bank account. Then you can make money from there. You have to have 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time. 4,000 hours of watch time in the last 365 days. So that's 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 the thing you need to know. Um, so yeah, you have to have that much to monetize your videos. Sponsors, three types of sponsors. Paid promotions. Uh, given promotions, which means they give you one of their products. So basically, paid promotions, they pay you to mention their app, their website, their products. Yeah, so basically 
that. They pay you to mention it. 30, 30 seconds to one, to a minute of mentioning them. That'll help you out. Oh, dear. I have to read some of the comments real fast. Um, products, when they get they send you one of their products and you have to show it, basically as if they sent you, if they were a mouse company, they'd send you a mouse. You'd have to show how nice it is. Use it around. It, it's got a keyboard if it has a keyboard on the side. Oh, it's got this nice key, colorful keyboard on the side. It has lights on it. Um, it's got a nice scroll. It works great. It's got a good distance. You can explain things like that. And you have to have a certain amount of people. You have to have at least a couple people that would buy the product to encourage the company to sponsor you. So, yeah, that's how to make money. There's a couple videos on the internet that it take a long time to explain. That's the quickness of it. So I don't know the other way, by the way. I have no idea of the other way, how to make money from sponsors. G. Lucas. Uh, the NFS series. What is that? Is that football? Okay, I thought you were talking about my channel. I was like, what is that? Um, I was think I was thinking you're talking about plushie files or something. Uh, I just found out the plushie files episode two is about to hit a thousand views. We have to reboot that. That that's like a that's that series is gone. But we have to redo that because that's doing so well. That's like one of the fastest growing videos on my channel right now. NFS, it's Need for Speed. That seems like a good game. I like car games. I like. Like the drifting, I'm pretty good at drifting in card games. Google it, pal. Kelpie horse. Kelpie dog showed up. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. It's a mythical creature. That looks pretty cool. Wow. Did you just prove I'm looking at it? I'm pretty sure it's a horse with only front legs is what the picture shows. It has no legs. It has a tail. It kind of looks like a dragon. That's pretty cool. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I can't read that. It's in a different language. Are you reading these words on the computer screen? Yes, I'm reading these words on the computer screen. It's a little bit to the right of the camera. Uh, what you... Oh, what's the language? Okay. Chill, are you drunk? Here, I'll copy it and paste it, and we'll see. Okay, too much going on. There's too much going on right now. Uh, by the way, guys, I'm going to slow down the replying to comments because it's it's hard. It's actually really hard. It did not translate right. It says... Cancer Rup, dude. Cancer Wanderer. I have no idea what that means. Okay. Uh, hope you have a great day. Night, Oakley. Uh, night, Raymond. Good night. Hope you sleep well. Different language. Yeah, buddy. Momo and, uh, oh, Momo. Oh, dear. Don't get me started with that. NSF is Need for Speed Games. Yeah, I saw that. It's pretty cool. Um, I think I be, might be into that if I could afford it. <laughs> um, yeah, I shouldn't, Chris. Are you Irish? Oh, slow me down. You're Scottish. You even say it. <laughs> Your name, Koga Scottish Pokey Trainer. I thought you were like, it sounded Irish for a minute. Yeah. Fook. Okay. F O O K is how you're spelling it. Um, and you're saying, yeah. What will ya? That will ya? You shouldn't cast like that, will ya? I don't know what that was, but yeah, you're talking. It's kind of a Irish, so. Scottish, I guess. You have. You have played that game, Need for Speed game. Oh, you love it. I might love it. I don't know. Uh, there's so much going on. The Kelpie Horse, the Need for Speed, Fallout, Skyrim, Elder Scrolls. 
Holy crap. Okay. Guys, stop. So he can read. <laughs> I know, right? Holy crap, there's so many people. Okay. Two faces. Next Google, Victor Scobberger, and look at the images and diagrams of his research. I'm trying to recreate one of his experiments. There aren't no freaking. Oh no, I'm scared. Is, is he. He's probably from the. Um, he's probably from the Soviet Union. Uh, no offense. Why did I just Google Translate it? There's something wrong with me. Okay, next Google. Dear. Sounds like someone's mad. What the heck? He did water? That looks weird. Um, okay. That looks strange. I think I might sub to your channel. Give me a good reason. I'm stupid. I do random stuff. You can see animals up close. You can see a, a, a weird kid do random stuff. How often do I live stream? I off stream, I live stream a lot. Like I'm doing this every Monday. I'm doing this every Monday. I'm doing this podcast. I might add on Friday. So every Monday and Friday, I might do this podcast at three to four o'clock starting time. Um, I usually live stream like twice. Sometimes I do. It's like a spree. Sometimes I do it like every day for like a week. I up. I us, I upload a lot. You just said to my channel, thank you for subscribing. Um, but yeah, I upload usually a lot. If you look back into my trending times, I uploaded almost every single day. So that's pretty impressive on my part. It's pretty hard to do that, but I'm homeschooled, so it's easier. So yeah, that was the bad live stream. A lot. Screw Koga. Who's Koga? Oh, what? Dang, everyone's being mean to Koga. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to have to... I'm sorry about this, but I'm going to have to get rid of that comment. Okay. I'm so sorry for deleting some of your comments because... YouTube actually, like, takes videos down now because of comments. So, please don't... Please be nice. Um... Please. Thank you for subscribing. How old am I? I'm 13. 13. My birthday is unknown. I think 15. 15. Dang. I'm 13. Chill. I'm really tall, but 13. Uh, will you ever live stream when you go to the lakes? Probably not. I, don't, I usually don't live stream on lakes because there's no service. Or do you play chest? Uh, no. Like, what can't you say in a comment? Cuss words. You can't say cuss words. You usually can't make fun of somebody. Please don't make fun of anybody. You could say screw. I don't care if you say that. I'm sure YouTube doesn't either. But please don't get, like cuss words and stuff because YouTube will take down all my videos and my channel will be deleted so hope you have a great day night Oakley later bye Raymond good night I'll do a golf clap for you okay because my brother looks like you and he is 14 14 wow I'm six six foot almost now, so are you fourteen this year? Yes, I will turn fourteen this year. What did I what did I do? How come the height? I don't know. It's be I guess because you were saying something earlier. What did you say earlier? I think you triggered someone earlier. 
You said you were talking to Boysen, and I guess that created hate, so that's probably why. Okay, I'm going to sit back for a second, because I read all the comments now. Wait. This is not a gun sign. This is a Naruto pose, I think. I think this is it. That. Something like that. I didn't see that. I don't think... I don't know. Oh. It, it's because apparently you did the... Sign. So... And people are fighting in my live chat. Okay. Keyboard. Oh dear. What what just happened? Something happened. I made a beep. Put that there. Um I don't know. I don't know why my voice is deep. I have no idea, and um, it might have something to do with the fact that I can really change my voice. Um, I can do, I can do like different voices, and like I'm pretty good at um, doing voice impressions. I can do quite a few. And I actually found out today I can do Mr. Burns from The Simpsons. So that's that's a pretty cool thing. I can do Mr. Burns, Mickey Mouse. I can do, uh, what's his name from Aerosmith? I can do the lead singer. I can even do his lips. Yeah. It looks, it looks more like him in real life when you see it. The lighting is weird, so you can't really tell. And, um... But I can I can go that I can go really high with my voice. I can do tons of really high voices. Um, it will absolutely murder your ears though. So that's a thing. I have no idea why my voice is deep. Uh, at least it's not like Markiplier, because his voice is like super deep. So like, and then we have Adam's apples. If you look at your neck, girls sometimes have it, but usually girls don't because usually girls don't have like super deep voices. But your the the bigger Adam's apple is, the deeper your voice gets. Uh, and if you notice, when I do high voices, my it goes up, and when I do deep voices, it goes down, up, down, up, down, up, down. See, so that's the thing I learned. If you can learn how to move it up, then you can do like a higher voice. It's yeah, I found that out, so. Okay, Koga apologizes, so everybody be nice to Koga. <laughs> um, anyway. <laughs> See, I can go really high with my voice, so. You wish that I went to your school. Yeah, um school I went to was pretty bad. There was a lot of bullying. Bullying wasn't actually a problem. There was too many gangs. Um, there was a lot of really bad stuff that happened in that school. There was no school shootings, but there was a couple threats. So, yeah, my school was pretty, pretty, pretty bad. Um, I don't think I was mean. Um, pretty sure I wasn't. <laughs> um, 
but usually if somebody said anything to one of my friends or somebody I know or somebody said something to me, I would, like, I will defend myself, so. Okay, so basically at my school, somebody was rude to you, you can stand up, and you usually have friends that would stand up for you, and then it would become a fight or something. Um, if you straight up push me around and was mean to me or one of my friends, I I will. Um, if you ever mess with them in front of me, I'll jump in and I'll throw a couple punches, so be careful what you do around me. So, yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much for liking my show. This is Talk Attack. Uh, that's a golfer announcer. What do you mean a golf announcer? What do you mean the voice? I don't remember which voice you did. If this is a golf voice, um, thank you very much. I, I applause. I applause. I very much applause. Um, I don't know what accent I'm going for here, but uh, it's it's happening. It's it's all it's happening. It's happening. All right, it's happening right now, right here, right here, right now. It's it's going on. I'm gonna be a bit of with five dollar, five dollar, five dollar. Oh, five dollar goes to the man in the back with the red shirt and six dollars, six dollars, six 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 six. Oh, anybody gets six? Oh, six goes to the woman in the blue shirt in the back. Uh, yes. So. Oh. It is okay, but it, because someone said something and took took the ear annoyed for him. Oh, I don't. I have no idea. Okay, yeah, be pals. Go announce your voice. Yes. Um. And Kobe has hit a birdie. He has got. That is his. That is a very impressive start for a golfer. And um, Jake Kobe has a he's got a Kobe has got has hit a has hit a birdie, and that is three for him, I think. Um, and Jake is not looking so good. He is gutting. He has a um, eleven. And, um, hope. Okay, so, uh, Jehovah. Jehovah has got a great start with a hole in one. Um, <laughs> yes, people need to stop cussing. Uh, please. What am I always good? Um, depends on what you mean by that. What do you mean by always good? You seem like a nice person, but are you always good or not? I don't know what you mean by that. I, if, if, I, I can be friends with anybody. If, if you're nice enough and if you're not a pervert, I, I, will, I will be friends with you. I don't care about your age. I don't care about that. Um, I'm cool with hanging out. If you're a pervert, I'm immediately rejecting that and shoving you away from my life. Um... If you have bad intentions, I will not mess with, I'm not going near you. So, yeah. There would a slight Australian twang in the last voice. Oh, I might. It was an Australian accent. Yeah, it was an Australian accent in everything I do. Swat tying on the western of Australia. Or Austria. I'm, t I'm told they say Australia. Like Austria. Austria is another country, but that's not Australia. But, um. Love, love this gut. <laughs> love the gut. You gotta love the gut. Um, uh, would it be right back, back? Yes. Yeah. I will see you guys when 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 you come back. Uh, did I say Jehovah? Yes, I said Jehovah. I don't. I didn't, I couldn't think of a name, so I just went with Je Jehovah. Um. Yes. Behave, dude. Or not, that is what I mean. Good behaved. No, not always. Um, I don't know I don't know what you mean. Good behaved to who? Friends? If something bad happens, I will feel really bad. But um I don't know what you mean by well behaved. I try to be well behaved a lot most of the time. 
I can be not well behaved, but that's not usual. Um, I don't think I'm the one to ask. I don't know. I honestly have no idea. They say Australia. Oh, Australia. Now, we're off the western coast of Australia. Australia. And um, it's very, very dangerous. Dangerous in the wild. Wild, wild animals here. Now, there's saltwater crocodiles. I there's monkeys and they're all they're all dangerous. That monkey can rip your head off. Yeah, it's very dangerous. Very. All right. See you around. Go, uh, yo, Koga. I lived in Perth, Australia for three three years. That's pretty cool to live in Australia. It's a nice place, I think. It's got a lot of dangerous ant wildlife there. So thank you for enjoying and stopping by to watch the video. Um I might end it here, honestly, because this is turning weird, and it's already been an hour and six minutes, so thank you guys for watching. Um, next Monday or next Friday, I will see you guys back with a, another episode of Talk Tech. This is the new setting, and hopefully we'll have a, um, a guest on the podcast. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in for the wild attack. Um, see you, see you all next time. Like and subscribe if you want to. Yeah, go check out everybody else. Shout out to everybody who joined my channel because my channel is currently dying. So, yeah, you're North, North New Zealand. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and see 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 you guys next time. Peace. Out.